All right, guys, so starting position is going to be pretty important for all of our Olympic lifts. If we start well, we're going to end well. So here, you're looking at Chuck. He's kind of, it's not a bad starting position. His back's neutral, his shoulders higher than his hips, hips higher than his knees, but his butt's way behind the bar. His whole body's kind of behind the bar. It's going to be hard to get the bar into a good low hang position where you can effectively jump the bar up. So today we're going to kind of work on pulling ourselves into that position. We're going to push our knees out. Notice how his groin then got closer to the bar. His chest is more upright. His back is nice and arched. He's actively pulling up on that bar and pulling himself into the floor. And he's going to do this multiple times, just getting comfortable in that position, using the weight of the bar to pull himself down, kind of hold himself in that position for 15 or so seconds, just getting more familiar with this position, stretching stuff out by using the weight of the bar. Good. And the more he does this, the more comfortable this position is going to be, and the easier it's going to be to get into that good low hang position to really jump that weight off the ground. So today, for our stretching, use that bar, pull yourself into that position, hold it for 15 or so seconds, do it 10 times or so, keep doing it until it feels comfortable. I already you can see Chuck has a much better starting position at the end there. How does that feel, Chuck? Tight. Tight, tight but getting better, right? Right, okay. Go get him, guys.